as a football coach, if you're not excited this time of year, you're in the wrong profession. You know, every year, and, and, and I told my wife this, I said, when I don't think we can win here, or I don't think we're doing a good, good job and uh, building character and building kids that graduate, then it's time for me to get out. But no, this is the most exciting time of the year. And on paper, we've brought in a lot of kids that can compete for playing time right now with a lot of kids that have played before in the past. Um, and so we'll have competition everywhere. So our student athletes that are coming in, you know, the one thing I tell them, they will get the opportunity to compete. And then from there, if they're able to compete, then yeah, and, and it's easy in football. Those who make plays play. The new turf, I, I think we're very fortunate to have, you know, the West family and Flip and Gary West. And, you know, the idea was first presented as they were coming out with a uh, pad that was for safety. Um, that's the only thing it was built for is to stop the whiplash effect that causes 90% of the concussions that happen in football. The other thing that uh, was fairly unsafe for us was the track, you know, it was getting deteriorated where, you know, most of it was breaking down the asphalt and cement and we were having kids fall on it and everybody might think it's for visual or for football only, you know, this is the safety factor that I thought and, you know, fortunately Mr. West agreed that we needed to address and address right away. Yeah, we don't really know a whole lot about either of the teams, even though Wheeling's, you know, a couple miles down the hill here. Um, we don't know too much about them. Um, I haven't seen film on them. You know, I'm more concerned about how we approach things and what we do. We have the talent. It's getting all the talent on the field at the same time playing together. This is a team sport. I've never seen a football game where one guy is totally taking over the game and making 11 guys miss. And but that's the one thing is we need to play as a team. There's, there's not one play in a game that loses you the game, nor is there one play in a game that wins you the game. Even though there could be a play made at the end of the game that wins you or lose your game. But if you made, there was probably 150 plays before that and if you would have made five of those plays you wouldn't be in the position that you were in for the end of the game. So there's many many things that go into winning football games other than the last play of the game. But we do practice them <laughs> because it might come to that but if you can avoid that that's when you're a good football team.